Mira las diferencias. Mira Cantana. Look at the differences between us. A body that has only seen this country. A body that knows voices both inside and outside of these borders. A body that has spoken in English as broken as their home. A body that can't look into its past. But a body that can listen to it. And a body that can say its own story. Aunque nacimos aquí. En Castojalca, no nos dan enough. Though we are born here, our, our families, families come, come from, from everywhere. everywhere. Mm -hmm. Mine starts in Europe. Sorry, soldiers in swastikas, arms pointed to the sky, frozen feet forced down the gritty paths of Yugoslavia and down the road to Tria as my family did not find a home in Mussolini's arms. Though they were tuned into the constant cumbia and laughter of El Salvador, my family couldn't always hear it over the booming death tolls. The ringing of gunshots were not far off echoes. We're not distant reports going through the radio, but were blasting through the neighborhoods. Crystal clear noise, even through times of peace, but they still kept the rhythms of their country close and kept them on repeat. Mine, America told us a tale that we were welcome here. Rumors of a free country was for now years across the Atlantic, enticing after my government said power over people and forced me to speak the words of my home so loud to block out the noise of violence flooding the streets of Mogadishu, forcing, forcing them, them to, to the, the free land. land. We have a lot to offer. Everyone loves ravioli. Loves our imported slang. Loves our beating on our clothing. Loves the works of Botticelli. Loves our spicy actresses on screen. Loves our dancing and music. But they don't love us. They picked what they wanted and embraced it. Never thought to look back where it came from or who made it. Met by bombs, they're accused of being mafia. They're beaten, strung up, and executed. The white. My family was not welcome. Met by immigration quotas and caps. It was hard to get here. And once here, they were met by expectations the quarantine from their throat, not to vibrate but to silence, to keep the accent hidden under the tongue along with the language that birthed it so it couldn't be heard over the already settled masses. Wouldn't include a melody they couldn't understand and wouldn't make them try. Met by travel bans and TSA terror watch list, my mother's hijab was made to a weapon, forcing her to disarm herself so she could be American enough and make you feel safe enough while she exists here. Change wasn't welcome, pero todavía estamos aquí. En Costojal Khan, I'm Joga. But we're still here. As I fixed myself for the American dreams, cracks began to appear in my mother's story. Our parents' nightmare of their children forgetting about the journey is becoming the reality. The late night stories still make their way to my uncovered ears, the ones that buzz with all the melody that was in one and now makes the most of what I listen to. I never got the history lesson because the timeline got too fuzzy. This got lost after falling from their lips to the next the same way their language did. But, but they're, they're still, still a part of us. us. And though their accents may not rest in my mouth, their stories still resonate in my ears. Their memories live in my eyes. So, so you, you can, can tell us. Speak no evil. Hear no evil. See no evil. But, but these, these are stories of evil. They're stories of immigration. Where all of our stories began.